Good evening, Master Tanaka. Good evening. Good evening, friend Chano. There are different vibrations today. Vibrations coming from different places now, but positive vibrations that allow us to continue transmitting our messages to you, special human beings. I am grateful for the efforts of Master Tanaka, who even in his time of leisure, provides us with this unique moment so that we can communicate with you, human beings. Communications are very important. All of us here understand the need for you to rest, but we also thank you very much for the commitment even during this moment. We are always ready for when you call us, okay, Master? Yes. Very well. We, beings of light, of the Brotherhoods, are here. Not only us from the White Brotherhood, but also all the other Brotherhoods in conjunction to complement our knowledge to you human beings. Today, we are going to talk, Master Tanaka, about some issues related to the other Brotherhoods. As we have said already before, at the very beginning, we have here not only the members of the White Brotherhood, but also the members of the Indigenous Brotherhood, the Brotherhood focused on African culture, that in conjunction right here in Brazil formed a great brotherhood that is the brotherhood of Umbanda, of Candomblé. All of them of African origin are the spirits who are here with us today. Spirits of light, little understood because they act in a different vibration from the other brotherhoods, but who are part of our great council, of our great group, we can put it like this. We are always learning a lot among ourselves, exchanging experiences, exchanging information, complementing ourselves to have an even broader knowledge so that we can be united for the benefit of the entire planet earth always for the benefit of, of the entire planet earth as well said by our friends brotherhoods related to african culture come from a different planet than other brotherhoods aryan brotherhood Oriental Brotherhood, etc. These spirits of light of the African Brotherhoods have different capacities, act on a different energy level, and for this reason, they are confused by many people. They are even the result of many misunderstanding by other people by other members. But we are learning a lot from the proximity of this brotherhood. For example, regarding the issue of teleportation and the issue of levitation, we can say that they are very developed. We have much to learn from all the actions that have long been used by them in the subject of teleportation and levitation. Little by little, we are becoming aware of these issues in order to bring information, teachings to all these friends, special human beings that we consider sources of light, who will bring a differentiated energy that will be in charge of planet Earth very soon. Therefore, we can work together so that these actions, especially levitation, 
are achieved more easily. It must be said that human beings who have already achieved this process and who follow this specific brotherhood of African culture are having enough success in a way that is more feasible for humans. Therefore, we will gradually, Master Tanaka, become acquainted with these actions and we will gradually prepare you more effectively, more closely to the reality of the human being in this contemporary phase. We have a lot to learn. The basis of everything they have been sharing with us is the subject of rhythms, is the question of music, of the vibrations emitted by their musical instruments that provoke a reaction in the physical body, as if it was entering in a trance. There is a greater ease in disconnecting all the connections which prevent the levitation process, which make these disconnections of the thoughts that inhibit this process. We are starting all this communication. We are starting these conversations here on the spiritual plane. And little by little, we will know better. We will make a greater interaction for the benefit of all humanity. This really is quite interesting for all of us. May we break our paradigms. May we increasingly act together, always for the benefit of human beings who will bring about the great changes in this new age. Therefore, I tell you, Master Tanaka, Friend Channel, and all those who hear us, this closeness between all brotherhoods is a historical landmark in the life of our brotherhoods. We can say that we never have reached such closeness before. Never have we reached such a connection between us between the various houses of the spiritual plane. Just as Jesus told us, the kingdom of God has many abodes, and that is what he refers to. All brotherhoods have in common the presence of God, the divine energy that works in all, all hearts all the hearts of the human beings, or beings of light, or beings of the astral plane. In other words, all beings have their divine share, their Christ-like self, their Christ-like energy. As Master Kuan Yin tells us so, the threefold flame is present in all beings. And more and more, we must get rid of our differences, our limiting beliefs, our prejudices, and work together to make everything go as smoothly as possible in this new age. And as we have said before, the leadership of this new age is located or has been geographically focused here on Brazilis land precisely because of the coexistence of a large representative part of all the brotherhoods who coexist in harmony. Unlike other nations, other great nations, where the distances between cultures of different origins are exceptionally large. Here in Brazilis land, 
it is possible to verify the coexistence of white people, indigenous people, black, westerners, living peacefully in a friendly way. Yes, with some differences. Yes, with some problems, but much closer than in most other nations. Therefore, here in Brazilian land, there is the highest probability of this combination of different cultures. And this combination has already brought many benefits on the spiritual plane. These benefits and those connections are going to get closer and closer. And this will also be reflected on you, Master Tanaka, friend channel, the disciples of Master Tanaka and other brotherhoods. That is why we made sure that our friend channel had contact with this culture, lived amongst the human beings of this culture, experienced the rituals that are done, that are performed, and more and more we are connecting and exchanging experiences to evolve, learning from all parties. We know very well that these brotherhoods of African origins have a greater proximity to the beings of the astral plane and that there is much to be done in this sphere. Although other brotherhoods also work through human beings, we still have to unite ourselves so that we can progressively bring evolution to humanity and increasingly get rid of unqualified energies. Very well, Master. May this be a first step and may you all be prepared to receive more detailed information and maintain a firmer connection, a stronger connection with these brothers of ours. Very well, Master Tanaka, may this be the milestone, the beginning of a great learning experience. I am sure this message was very well picked up by all of you. For many, it will be impactful, but I am sure that is for the good of all mankind. We are all brothers. We are all made of the same divine energy and we have much to learn. Gratitude to all of you. So be it. Thank God. Thank God.